there, young adventurers. I did not see you there. Nice to meet you. So, I hear you want to train dragons. But, don't skip too far. Because there are a bunch of dragons you need to learn to master out there. Such as the Skrill, the Red Death, the Deadly Nadder, Monstrous Nightmare, and so much more. Even the tiniest dragons, from the from the Nano Dragon to the Great Big Wildebeest, you have to learn to master them all. And today, we're going to start off with a well-known dragon called the Deadly Nadder. Deadly Nadders like to attack using their deadly poisonous spines. They're on its tail. It uses them to attack its foes. They raise up like this Deadly Nadder model when, when they feel threatened to almost tell the attacker to run off. That it's dangerous. It will hurt it. Deadly Nadders also have the strongest of all fire breath of all dragons. It's the hottest. It's even hotter than a wildebeest or a red death or a nano dragon or a monstrous nightmare. It has the hottest breath of all dragons. We also have a blind spot. Like most dragons, most dragons have two eyes on the front of their head, such as this Night Fury. But some dragons, like me, have them on the side. So we have a blind spot, which is here. We can't see straight in front of us, but we can see behind us, to side, that side, and sometimes a little bit in front of us. So... Yeah, we don't like to use our fire that much, because we can't really see where, where we're aiming. That's why we like our riders, we have to depend on our riders to tell us where we're going. It's dinner time! Yes, dinner time. Deadly nadders, like me, go away. It's not your time, it's dinner time. Like dead, like... Night of Furies, like me, go away. Like Night of Furies, Deadly Nadders have, well, a very picky appetite. Yes, very picky appetite. <clears throat> they are allergic to hoofed domestic animals such as yaks and sheep. So they can eat fish. And chickens. A very famous rider called Asterisk discovered while riding her dragon Stormfly that if you feed a deadly nadder chicken, it will make it go faster due to its diet. So yeah. If you want to, if you want to be the fastest, deadly out feed a chicken, or eat chicken. I don't know. Hmm. Thank you, Dino. That was very useful. Ah, I know. You got, I got the power of not go away. Right. Okay. Now, how do you train this magnificent, magnificent beast? If you find one in the wild, it's probably never been ridden before. So, you need to make sure it's friend. First of all, like most dragons, you've got to put its hand on its nose so it can trust you. But don't look at it. And then after it's befriended you, it may lower its back. That's a signal that you can ride it. If it doesn't, Always carry some fish around. They will always help in a tricky situation. When you're finally on board that dragon, 
you're going to have to lick your hand and then you're going to have to rub it onto the dragon just to moist down its scales because they're probably dry and it'll really like that soon you'll become bestest of friends don't forget to wipe that mouth it's... why? <laughs> why? oh come on isn't it obvious ah! oh sorry I'm being chased down by an evil deadly nadder it's closing up on me it's getting closer and closer but don't worry if if you see a deadly nadder it's got remember a it's got a blind spot so if you stay in that blind spot it won't be able to see you crawl and, and run away as fast as you can so it can't spot you then you'll be able to run away while you're looking always look for nettles. If you get a deadly nettle and rub a nettle on its tummy then it will it will roll over and it will become paralysed and won't be able to see anything for about, an hour, for about half an hour. That's your chance to run. Uh oh, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming! <sighs> okay. I've got my nettle. Uh, <laughs> with a paralyzed deadly nadder. You're always wanting to befriend it, obviously. And yeah, do what I've just said. Make sure you wet yourself, lick your hands, rub it on its scales, put your hand on its nose, make sure you stay out of its blind spot if you want to be friends. Remember it has um, spikes on its tail. It's got the hottest fire of all dragons. And as always, thanks for watching.